The barber shops of Bristol are now a less adventurous place, ever since Charlie Stevens died over 80 years ago. Charlie was the demon barber of Bedminster, a showman and daredevil, decorated in the war and winning medals for bravery in peacetime. He wouldn't flinch in front of knife throwers. Apples were sliced in two on his throat. In his spare time, he enjoyed the odd parachute jump. He would box lions and shave his customers in a lion's cage. How did he get a lion into his shop? Suppose health and safety would cut that out now. Charlie's most spectacular attempt was to cross the Niagara Falls in a barrel. He had one specially made by a cooper in Bath for £20 in 1920, then his life savings. The barrel was state-of-the-art, made with sturdy Russian oak, a spacious interior with a 32-inch diameter, waterproof, obviously, and fitted with an electric light. Lead weight would ensure the barrel stayed upright, but many critics felt it was too large and heavy. Charlie thought not, and for extra weight and good luck, he insisted on taking an anvil with him. On that fateful morning, Charlie was strapped inside the barrel and launched upstream. He bobbed towards the edge of the falls. The critics were sadly proved correct. The barrel crashed against the bottom of the river with such force that only a single piece of Russian oak was recovered, with his right arm still attached. Charlie Jr. followed in his father's footsteps and became a hairdresser. But the barbers of Bristol seem less daring these days. However, it leaves me wondering about Charles Stevens. Would you trust a man who does things like that to cut your hair?